Hello, welcome back to The Walking Dead by Telltale. Uh, this is a 2012 game. Uh, we're playing Season 1, Episode 2. Um, now, this is in the same universe as the comics. It's not in the same universe as the TV show. Uh, and this particular segment lines up with Issue 7. So, when the events happen in Issue 7, uh, they're happening here. Now, in issue seven, I think they were going through Wilshire Estate. So, when Rick's group was going through there, that's when they uh, these are playing out. These events are playing out for Lee Everett. Let's start. Now, the game makes you believe that your choices matter. They don't. You'll see that soon. <laughs> so we got Lee Everett. Three months later. Um, now you'll notice that I believe this character has the save lot uniform on it. Um, now these are going to be the enemies in the future. Damn it. What'd they get this time? Uh, looks like a rabbit. <sighs> well, that's another meal lost. So again they're I still fighting can't for believe food. We went through all that commissary food in three months. It seemed like so much at the time. Maybe you shouldn't have opened the door. Yeah, except then I'd probably be food by now. Trust me, I have no regrets. Uh, rabbit's hardly a meal, Mark, but I'd take it. So this oh, is a completely oh. new survivor no here, kidding. Mark. Last night I heard your friend Doug laying in bed just naming types of pie. It was driving me nuts. I think he's starting to lose it. He's not the only one. Won't you cut him some slack? Yeah, you're right. I wish I knew for sure how much food we have left. You'll have to ask Lily. She's the one handling the rations. Or mishandling it if you ask Kenny. He's just worried about his kid getting enough. I'll worry about Clementine, too. You think Kenny's having any more luck than we are out here? I sure hope so. Yeah, between the lack of food and Kenny and Lily fighting all the time, things are getting pretty tense back at the motor inn. You know, Kenny's been talking about taking off if he can get that RV running. Kenny won't abandon us. He's a good man. Yeah, I guess we'll see. Can't blame him, though. Did you hear Larry going off on him last night? What's the old guy's deal, anyway? Seems like he's got a problem with you in particular. <sighs> Larry's just... Uh, looking out for his daughter. Hey, I know Lily. She can take care of herself. He needs to take that energy and put it towards finding us some more food. And I know Lily thinks he's getting weaker, but the guy's all muscle. He's a walking pile driver. I know I wouldn't want to be stuck in a room with him. And didn't he punch you in the face one time? Uh, knock me flat. <laughs> um, so, Mark is just a someone who's randomly joined up to the party within the three month period. Uh, he's been surviving with them. That's all we know. We just suddenly, that's our introduction. Uh. It's a long shot. I'd hate to waste the bullets. Trust me. If I don't think I can hit it, I won't shoot. Ah! Shit! Was that Kenny? I don't know. Come on! And now we have our first situation. Jesus Christ. Oh shit, no, no, please don't kill us. We just want to help our teacher, we'll leave, I swear. Lee, you guys okay? Get, get it off, get it 
it off, God damn it! Get, get it off me! Travis! Maybe they can help! These might be the same guys that raided our camp, and we barely got away from that! What guys? Why the fuck is there a bear trap out here? Who raided your camp? I, I don't know! Guys with guns! Please, we won't bother you, I swear! Lee, this is fucked up. We've gotta help you. Please! Ben, shut up! My dad was special forces, I know what I'm doing! Just see if you can get him out! After that, you can leave us or whatever! I don't care! Please! Gotta get him out of there. Oh God, thank you. Fine, but you gotta hurry. Now, no matter hurry, what you please, do, hurry. you're not going to be able to get the guy out or we'll save, save this guy. Lee, uh, this trap been altered. There's no release latch. And that's a pertinent thing. If there's no release latch, oh, no. Um, it's been purposely designed to. Shit, walkers! It's now or never, Lee. Please, get me out of this. Mark, get the boys back. Kenny, keep those walkers off of me. Oh, I'm sorry. You have to get him out. You have to. Please, do something. Please, stop. stop. You can't just leave him like this. Please, oh. get me out of this. Why is this happening? Oh, oh, shit. Oh. No, no, no. Stop. <sighs> Fuck. Okay, there has on. to be a way out of this. Let's go. Let's go. Hurry. Come on, do something. <laughs> Or you can oh even do three. Lee, it has to be now. Why would somebody do this? Come on. Try something. This is bad. This is bad. bad. We use chain like that at the Air Force Base to lift orders. This can't You're be. You're not cutting happen. through that. There's got to be another way. Do you think Damn it, get it open? Just cut off his fucking leg. We don't have time for that. Is I'm he... sorry. Are you going to make it? Go. Now. I want my leg. I want my leg. He's lost so much blood already. Please Lee, hurry up. Quit fucking around. Try something else. Jesus, I need to oh, work. Man. I'm oh, just man. wasting ammo now. We gotta go. Oh Jesus, those things Maybe are gonna be right here. Over with this bridge. Oh God, oh, God. please so save him. him. Ah, ah. Please hurry, Come on. damn it! Get it off. Oh God, you this can't die. Really bad. Just get me out, please! There's so much blood. blood screaming. We're gonna be surrounded any minute. Please! Get There's gotta be something this. we can do. Calm down. Why is this we'll happening to us? This. Okay, hurry! Come on, we gotta go now. No! Uh, no! Don't leave me! Damn it, Lee! Uh, I'm sorry. No! Damn. We can't leave Mr. Parker like that. Give me the gun. Give it to God me! Damn it, Travis! So much for his dead being special Shit. forces. What happened? It was an accident! Oh god. Grab the kid and keep moving! Come on, move! You can't leave me like this. Please get me out. Now we'll talk about that later on. Um, so the very first thing that you saw with the Save Lock Kids, they this group even kill their own just keep that in mind um, now you had the opportunity of cutting that guy's leg off but he wouldn't survive the blood loss and you'll be traumatizing everyone else so even though you don't have much other opportunities um, it would be easier just to distract the walkers and because you're faster than them and distract the group elsewhere away from the guy in the trap but you're not given that option you hear someone in the background
and it's ah. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! Shit! What the hell are they doing? Come on, come oh on! My God. What happened? Oh, Who's that? Are these? Don't have time to explain. Please, Shit. Are you okay? Get him into the truck. I'll see what I can do. Cat, okay? can you fix him? Jesus, Ken. Lee. I, I don't know. Lee! What the hell? You can't just be bringing new people here. What are you thinking? Hey, you want to calm down for a fucking hey, minute? He would have died if we left him. So what? We are not responsible for every struggling survivor we come across. We have to focus on our group. Right here, right now. Come on, Lily. These are people. People trying to survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. The only reason you're here is because you had food. Enough for all of us. But that food is almost gone. We've got maybe a week's worth left. And I don't suppose you guys are carrying any groceries, are you? Um, no. Fine. You guys fight it out there. <sighs> Welcome to the family, kid. Come over here and see what I drew. Wh what? No, I... Just come on, okay? You, know, you like to think you're the leader of this little group, but we can make our own goddamn decisions. This isn't your own personal dictatorship. Hey, I didn't ask to lead this group. Everyone was happy to have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around, but now that it's running out, suddenly I'm a goddamn Nazi. Kenny's right. Yeah, you're in charge of the food and the schedules, but you're not in charge of people's lives. Really? You weren't there. Lee made a choice. End of story. Look, once Katja patches that guy up, you can kick him out of here. Send him out on their own. I couldn't care less. But they at least deserve a fighting chance against the Walkers. And for the record, Kenny wanted to leave those people behind. If Kenny would pull his head out of his ass for five seconds, he'd realize that I make these decisions to protect his family. We simply don't have enough food. I don't see any of you stepping up to make the hard decisions. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. Dad, please. Why don't you go help Mark with the wall? Come on, cute man. <laughs> you know what? If you think I'm doing such a shitty job, then you do it. And now we have the next That's test. all the food we have for today. You decide who gets to eat. Well, no, I'm serious. Pick up that food and start handing it out. You see how it feels to not have enough food for everyone. You only have four items for ten hungry people. How do you decide? And so this is what the game now tests you on, which isn't really that hard if you... if you really think... Uh, think about it um and Lee was right like we're just helping them we're not telling them they have to stay with our group forever and plus by helping them we don't know they might be able to help us later on um and that's the part that Lily's not really taking into consideration we'll talk to various people now is he gonna be okay I don't know can you give me a hand real quick sure what do you need just apply some pressure here while I try to close this up. You know, I thought I was starting to get used to this, sewing up people's injuries. What were you thinking bringing him here? Even if he lives, we aren't going to be able to take care of him. I did the right thing. Yeah, I know you did. The right thing is just scary sometimes, I guess. Well, you've done all you can, Lee. Thanks for the help. <laughs> Go ahead and check in on the others. I need a little space here anyway. Okay. So we've checked on her. So it's not hard because... How you doing, Clementine? Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If I find it, I'll let you know. Thank you. Okay, Clem. I've got to take care of some things. Why don't you go back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. Okay, um, so what we're going to do is we're going to give her the apple. You take care of the children. That just makes sense. Here, Clem. You need something to eat. Um, give 
Apple. I love apples. Thank you. Oh, wow, Are that's her favorite. No, honey. That was the last one. Oh, um... Enjoy it. You deserve it. Now, this guy's new to the group, so we're not going to give him anything, because that would just be stupid. Hey, is my friend gonna he make might it? have just eaten. I don't know, but Kaja will do her best. I promise. I can't believe we just left Mr. Parker there. I tried. I really did. I just ran out of time. There was nothing else we could do. So who are you people? Our group's gonna want to know. I'm Ben. Ben Paul. The guy in the truck is Travis. He played in the school band with me. Mr. Parker was the band director, but... God, I can't believe we left him. How you holding up, kid? Uh, well, I, uh... I keep wondering if I could have done something to help, you know? Some kind of... I don't know. Something. I'm sure you did all you could. Yeah, maybe. Okay, so that's... Relax. We'll get your friend back to normal in no time. I sure hope so. So now we're going to talk to... Doug. How you doing, Doug? I'm okay. Me and Clementine are coloring. Guess what it is? I don't know. A dog? Nope. Oh, I know. It's a goat, right? No. <laughs> You're bad artist, you were kid. pretty brave when we brought those people in here. That's because I know Mom can fix him. Hey, Doc. How about a little food? So, by giving um, Doug... Yeah.